Hey YouTube, what's up? This is uh, Cody for Noobs, and this is your second game tutorial. As you can see, I'm still IT rendering the first tutorial. I just kind of started this right away because this is actually kind of fun, so I'm just going to minimize that. And we'll get back. So this is the code we had before. If you guys remember, this is going to make your player move over three, and then this uh, refreshes it so it actually shows it on your screen. Now let's do the rest of the movements. Um, sorry, it's a little laggy now. Because, uh, I'm recording and uh, rendering. Anyway, so, um, oh, apparently it's shut. That's weird. Oh no, it's because I opened up a second one. My bad, guys. Alright, so if e dot key data equals keys dot left. I mean, yeah, he's got left. <coughs> Sorry, guys. Um, then player dot left minus equals three. This will do the exact opposite of what the keys dot right will do. So if we run this game, he should move left. He move left. He can move backwards. Forward, backwards. Now you're thinking this is kind of dumb. He can only move forward and backwards. Okay, well, let's add up and down keys. So, uh, if e dot key dot key data equals keys dot up, then player dot top, I think it's supposed to be opposite, so we're going to do minus equals 3, and uh, we'll try it out to make sure I'm right. Yeah, see? You want to, uh, and then if e dot key data equals keys dot down, then player dot bottom minus equal three or plus equal three. Sorry, because you want to add to his top plus equal three or dot bottom. You look at me. I'm tired, guys. I'm sorry. Um, thing. Anyways, uh, now we have full player movement. Uh, as you can see, full player movement. Move anywhere I want. Uh, next, I'm gonna write the tutorial on. Uh, your enemy and how he's supposed to chase you because the point of this game will be for you to run away from your enemy. Alright guys, this is uh, the second Visual Basic game tutorial and we just finished the player movement. Let me go start the third video.